Yo, 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 what's up, family? Before we start the video, please leave a like, subscribe, and share to any and everyone that you can. Just read out there a little bit more. With that being said, let's get right into the video. The Boston Celtics just beat the Phoenix Suns 127-112 without Chris Aspazinius, and they got a lot of contributions from their guys, and one of the most important ones was Drew Holiday. He only had 9 points, but he had 10 assists with 2 steals and 2 blocks, and was a team high plus 26, and I felt it deserved a deeper look, so let's get into the film. Alright, so if you're new here, welcome, and if you're not, take your shoes off before you come in the house. And again, Drew Holiday does everything for this team. Again, he had 9 points, 10 assists, no turnovers two steals two blocks and one thing that he does is that he hits timely shots he's become a 44 percent three-point shooter for this team and here he projects the screen bradley bill goes under and he hits the three all right so this is one of the best sequences i can remember from drew this season so he gets the ball to the trailer who was paying pritchard he hits the shot crowd goes wild you know what i'm saying we have a lot of energy in a garden this was a great first quarter 10-2 run and then he comes back on defense and look at this right screen navigation right he gets the screen, he goes under it. Then this time, he changes the coverage, he goes over it. Bradley Bill tries to reject it. Nope, still with him, goes under it. Sw oh <laughs> Bro, he's not supposed to be able to beat Bradley Bill to the spot at this point. If you just take a snapshot of this, he's not supposed to be able to beat Bradley Bill all the way to the corner, right? He gets there, he meets him, pokes the ball away, forces Bradley Bill to pass the ball, and the play is not over, right? You see him, he's lurking, he's lurking. Now, the Celtics are in rotation, right? They sent two at KD because Cornell was checking them, right? So now they swing it. They swing it. The Celtics are in rotation. They get to the Eubanks and watch the point guard meet him at the summit. Block. Drew Holiday did everything on that possession, and he is a guy we need in the playoffs. Him being able to do this stuff and now is a 44% three-point shooter is just so great for this team. And along with those nine points and those two steals and those two blocks, he also had 10 assists with no turnovers. And here... This, he's, he's pushing the tempo, right? And this subtle behind the back brings Drew Eubanks' attention to Drew just for half a second longer, and he's able to sneak it into Luke Cornette. As the title states, Drew Holiday does everything for the Celtics, and Yusuf Nurkic had 20 rebounds in this game. Seven of them were offensive. Your big man is out contesting the shot on Devin Booker. He misses, and look what Drew Holiday is doing. He's the one that makes sure that there's a body on Yusuf Nurkic and we secure the possession. And here, just look at this play from Drew on Devin Booker. He's having PTSD from the finals, and look at that tie-up right there. Drew has some of the best hips in basketball. He can be a cornerback if he actually tried to. It's because of this right here. So look, T-Book kind of has him right there, right? Drew's stance is, is kind of wide. He's off balance, right? And against a lot of people, D-Book has a, a open lane, right? But watch how Drew flips his hips. Boom. Just that quick, he's back in front of Devin, and he gets his hand on the ball, and he ties him up. And then again, screen navigation. He's always fighting through screens. You're not going to see him cheating you on the effort side of things. And here, he draws off as a foul. All right, so here we go. Here, he's putting pressure on the ball. Active hands. Look, he's always switching his hand placement. He's showing his hands. He's up. He's up. He gets a steal, and it leads to a Tatum fast break. All right, so here he trails Bradley Bill. He gets the pickpocket steal. This should have been a foul on Al Horford, but Drew got a clean steal. He runs down, and again, 44% from three, but 40 on pull-up threes, and he hits that one. And again, the 10 assists, no turnovers. He flips it out to Al Horford, and he gets the three. And just look at how impactful this no-look pass is, right? He's drawing everybody. All Phoenix Suns defenders are looking at him. He's on the court with Jason Tatum. He has the ball, and there's five sets of eyes on him. And just look at how impactful this no-look pass is, right? So he's here, he's driving, he's looking directly at Sam Hauser. This pass is already halfway to Al Horford, and Royce O'Neal hasn't even turned around yet because Drew is looking at Sam Hauser the entire time. That extra half of a second is why this closeout is late and how over hits the three. All right, so here's some of the IQ, right? He has a pick and roll with his big man, Xavier Tillman, against two smalls, right? The big man is Yusuf. He's over there with Al Horford, right? So he knows that no matter what, who switches this, Xavier Tillman is going to have the size advantage. So you don't throw it to his feet. You don't throw it low. You just lob it up high. All you got to do is put some touch on it. Now Xavier Tillman can go to work on Devin Booker, and he scores in the post. And here, just another great pass, the underhand left hand flip to Sam Hauser for the layup. And of course, it can't be a Drew Holiday vid if we aren't showcasing his corner shooting. 65% from the corner this season, the best shooter in NBA history for a single season. He just sits there and he's automatic from this spot. 
but that is the video if you enjoyed it please again leave a like subscribe and share to any and everyone that you can just read out there a little bit more and i will see you guys in the next video but this is nick peace